Hi, I'm Zoe Saldana, and this is my hero. Everyone has that one special person in their life they call hero. The person who influenced who you are. You're welcome. Oh! And if you're lucky, you get to say thank you. You are our hero. Which is why my friends and I are showing our gratitude in a very big way. My beautiful friend Julianne Huff reveals the woman she calls hero. Hi, I'm Julianne Huff, and my hero is my sister Shari. We are on our way to Utah. I'm so excited because I'm basically going to go surprise my sister Shari uh, because she is my hero. And we are going to do something really special for her. Say thank you for being such a great example and inspiration for me my whole life. Something that she deserves too. So I'm really excited about the surprise. Super fun. I really leaned on my sister Shari between the ages of birth and six years old because my mom was sick when she was pregnant with me. She got Epstein-Barr disease, and so she was in and out of the hospital the entire nine months with me, and she was in bed for a lot of the, you know, a lot of my early years. And my sister was 11 years old, and she really just became another mom to me. This is crazy. Shari has never had a break. It's been one thing after the other. Even when she was a teenager, she had braces, and the braces messed up her mouth. And I mean, she's had teeth pulled. She's had so many root canals. She has, like, no enamel on her front teeth. It's just been bad luck after bad luck. Sherry has no idea that I flew in this morning from LA. Hi! <laughs> oh! <laughs> oh my, <laughs> my sister was put on this earth to be a mom, and she's going to put her kids before her any day. Hello! Greaters! <laughs> <laughs> Zoe Saldana reached out to me and asked about who my hero is. And um, are you going to start crying already? Because <laughs> I am. <laughs> so anyway, so when they, they came to me, I immediately thought of you. You have literally been the one person that I've looked up to who's been so consistent in my life. And when I see who you are as a mother and as a sister and as a wife, you kind of inspired everything basically to be why to be where i'm at today because you started with your dance and performing and you were you were kind of the first person to do everything and we followed in your footsteps so i owe a lot to you <laughs> you are my hero oh my gosh <laughs> You're pretty unbelievable, sis. You know, my sister, she had a lot of dreams. You know, she wanted to go to New York and dance and do all these things. And she chose to be a mom and she chose to be a wife. And I look at it as that was the best decision that she ever made. You know, they might not be wealthy, but to me, they are rich beyond belief. How do we do the family hug? Family hug. Family hug. There's a second surprise, but I'm not going to tell you what that is because we're not going to a brunch or whatever you thought you were going to. But we are getting in a car. Okay, let's go. Okay, oh my god. Surprise gosh. number two. I still don't know what's happening, really. I'm so nervous. <laughs> <laughs> but I'm excited, and I'm so surprised. Oh my gosh. Give me your hands. OK. We're here. <laughs> <laughs> this way. <laughs> Come this way. <laughs> oh my gosh. And then we're going to stand right here. OK. OK, so I wanted to do this because this is something that is really going to help you. So we are going to. Fix your teeth. Oh! Oh my gosh! Oh my Surprise! Gosh. <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> I am surprising my sister with basically an entire new mouth <laughs> because she is my hero and she deserves to be pain free. I felt like this was really important because this is all about you and the struggles that you go through during the day, nobody would ever know because you choose to be happy and you choose to be positive and you are literally are my hero for doing that. I just don't want her to be in pain anymore. I'm going to do the crowns on your front six teeth. I'm going to help replace the teeth that you're missing. Awesome. I'm going to do the work of reconstructing the dental implants. <laughs> Thank you. I'm just in shock. Like, Randall had really pushed to start getting me into the dentist. But I, I kind of was like, no, I, I don't want to do that because we really can't afford that. And so I just kind of pushed back a little bit. And um, so, oh, anyways, thanks. <laughs> <laughs> Yay. <laughs> yeah. It's been, a long, it's been a long time with my teeth. I don't know why I have such bad teeth, but um, I've had a lot of pain, a lot of pain, and it's gonna be awesome to not be in pain anymore. <laughs> so. I will be able to chew. I know. <laughs> Hopefully I'll be a better mom, a better person, because oh. I won't be in pain. <laughs> <laughs> I love you, sissy. Love you too. She had her wisdom teeth pulled. She had three implants. She had two root canals, one on top, one on bottom, and she's getting her six front veneers. And then she's getting braces to straighten them. She's getting all of that done at once, and she's just a fighter. Still a little swollen. So after many years of just agony, and of course, all of these surgeries, the implants, everything, uh, we're now ready to reveal Shari's new smile. We've flown in friends from New York, Dominican Republic, and Los Angeles to come and help us celebrate what she has been.